man. And uh, when it comes down to it, it's like you have Fountain, horrible for Falcon. You have Yoshi's, horrible because he doesn't have space to move. And then you have uh, and you have FD where your lasers are free. It does seem like he's really bad on FD though, so but like maybe you don't want to go there. But how do I say it's all personal preference? Because if your play style doesn't suit what the stage gives you an advantage in, then y it's not an advantage. Yeah, but I feel like to like there are play like specific play styles and stuff, but neutral should be relatively linear for most matchups. Like no, it's not so like if. It <laughs> Okay, there goes that lead. Um, like, you know, um, th th there's not going to be a single Falcon-Falco combo where the Falco's not going to shoot a lot of lasers to get into neutral, you know? And so, like, when you take, like, FD and, like, Pokey being really good laser stages, you know, every Falco's going to do that. I respect his, uh, his okay. personal preference. I like choice. what's going on. Yeah. He's pushing him out of the center. He, and he just let him right back in. Get him out. Yeah, but he did bait out the throw, so I guess it's okay. Yeah. Because okay. you can't contest okay. space too aggressively sometimes, otherwise you'll just get caught by a hitbox. True that. Okay. Okay, punish. That was a very ill-informed side B. Because yeah, for sure. Sonny he wasn't even on Yeah, the he ground. was nowhere near there. <laughs> <laughs> he would have had he to purposely try to run into it. going up to top platform when he threw out that side B. So that makes me feel like it was a... Good grab. Some sort of mixed miss play. Almost every time somebody get, does normal get up on ledge at that percent, it's because they meant to do like a ledge dash or something and messed up. And so you can always expect them to just get scared and hold shields. So like grab is like, oh, he's gonna beat that. Yep. I do that. Like I sit there and hold shield. Like yeah. Every same. Time. Like, it's such a bad habit. For me. Yeah. Because you you just like do like freeze. Oh too. my god. Sunny does these weird edge guards against Falcon where he just dips super like super low. I yeah, love but it. But he gets on him. Like yeah. that's what I like. He Sunny makes sure the stock finishes off stage if he can. Yeah, like he goes so low that you feel safe. You feel safe going high. Yep. But like if you're not high enough, like Falco's double jump is huge and he will catch you. So right, it's a really jump's good bait. Huge and then the double jump's just a stupid addition. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I uh, like that. Oh, oh, come on. I oh, thought oh. that was a down air, I but think that I think he could have squeezed out an up air, or Falcon could have done something out of it. Possibly, Battlefield, but... Battlefield, man. Like, I hate seeing the you slide down yeah. ever so slightly under the ledge, because fuck you, that's why. Especially if you look at how low, like, characters like space animals can grab on other stages, and you're like, sometimes you're just like, I know I'm going to grab yeah, that so on another stage. you're just trying to go for the safe recovery, and it ends up fucking you, because Battlefield. Yeah. I like that. Yep. <laughs> just... I'm out the short hop Grab ledge, yep, there we go. Sunny used to like literally never grab ledge. And like now he does it a little bit like, you know, if he's really far ahead, okay, he tries to I do like swag, that. but. Why did he just sit there and shield when he air dodged? He could have just capitalized. That was so free. Yeah, it was. He was in free fall. I guess it's and just Sunny like. Sunny was actionable out of shield. I think it's just uh, fast fall nerves. Or, or oh. uh, fast fall or last stock nerves. Because these stocks end so quick for both characters. Like literally right now, double knee ends. He does double me. I'm gonna laugh. Oh my god! He covered wow. three out of four. Not the not the fourth. That was a good option to select from Sunny because the option coverage was preemptive, so it wasn't really. Yeah. That was. And that's like good that's awareness. A, that's yeah, really the, hard to do, especially last stock. That's the difference between like players that are uh, that are very good at edge guarding and players that aren't is usually the setup before the edge guard, not the actual application of it. Uh huh. So the application is just a sequential button press. Yeah, exactly. Almost a quick time event, except the screens aren't up. The <laughs> buttons aren't up on the screen. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Okay. Good combo. I like what Sonny's doing here. He's taking full advantage of every inch of. Oh my yeah. god. That was. So beautifully handled. Very textbook. That that wasn't even cheese or anything. That was just a well played. See, look at that. That yep. that's He's just baiting out the grab. He's all over him. Sunny always say like Sunny heats up after the first game. Yeah, he does. Like, he learns habits. Cause now he's punishing all the things that I was going to say he wasn't punishing in the first game, but I've learned to wait a second. Yeah, and see if they pick up him. on it. Yeah. Because as a commentator, it's also like you waste so much time talking about something which they could solve between games, because yeah. most players do that. Yeah, so unless you're like commentating Wizzy and you know there's going to be a 20 minute break <laughs> in between games. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Then, uh, He's gonna go to the bathroom, <laughs> but then also like go on a short date with a woman, <laughs> and 
like rob a bank. And, <laughs> and on the way to all those things, he has to take the bus, but he didn't take the bus to wash his hands waiting. and pee between each activity. True. But, um, Sunny had a pretty comfortable lead. I'm actually uh, surprised that oh. Dreamland came through. Oh. Like, even aside from personal preference, against me, Sunny banned Dreamland. <laughs> okay. Oh, that was okay. a really bad whiff, though. Oh my gosh. My though. titties. That, that would have been so hyped, though, if he got he that nair back SD'd, air. SD'd, and then SD'd. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> he was like, wait, I didn't do it the first time. Hold on. I know. That's like the ultimate homie sock. Like Falcon almost SD'd, SD'd so he SD'd, SD'd himself. <laughs> with an SD. <laughs> <laughs> like, beautiful. He said, Falcon, you take 17%, and I'll take my stock. Okay. Yeah, Sonny needs to start getting back into zone. Because the SD, like, kind of yeah. down there for a second. Yeah, but so I think uh, I think Falcon's still flustered, so it's gonna be really hard for N to uh, continue. He's going in on the wrong, like in the on the wrong angles with Falcon. He's yeah. going in on the diagonal up and under angles, yeah. and that's just bad because Stomp and Nair and Up Air cover all of those. I don't like the Falcon kick there either. Yeah, I don't know. That's why I think somebody like the cool. But, um, okay, okay. even most of the time, when they're at low percent, you do hit them with the Falcon Kick. They actually have enough time to punish. That was a really sick platform cancel nice. back air into yeah. actual shield drop back air. <laughs> and there's some fade. fancy shit, and he just was caught falling. Yeah. Just Falcon's falling. really funny about that. Like, sometimes he'll just get, like, really bodied, and he respawns, he just needs you. And then you're like, okay, now everyone forgot what you just did, because you got hard need in neutral. Oh my gosh. See, he's dancing. There you go. He needs to keep doing that. Like, Yeah, because if you notice, right like, Falcon angles. literally just shield grab into shield grab into shield grab. He had no idea what to do. Wow, okay. Go recover. Okay. He has another stock to work with, but I hate seeing the SDs. Just yeah, for sure. Right. Oh, this is clean melee. Especially, like, see, he's not even, like, SD trading the stocks. He's kind of just dying. Like, you know, sometimes you could do a tactical trade of stocks, but. Okay. He's uh, so fast. That down uh, air is hilarious. Sunny, like, he was to... in front of him, and it still hit him. Yeah, for sure. And that's that. Yep, there we go. Sunny, compared to most Falcos, is really, really good at doing a backwards wave dash out of shield into a dash. Because, like, you know, LV, not particularly known for playing on UCF, so he's definitely used to getting dash backs. <laughs> So he's so good at like. Wait, LB's not used to playing on UCF. Yeah, we we play UCF on all our melee setups. When I started here, uh, a couple months ago at least, or like a month ago, no, more than a month ago, a few months ago, um, we a couple tourneys might not end up having UCF if like they don't have enough memory cards. Smash or Quest, shit, I think, was the first tournament that they actually started playing UCF. Oh. Yeah, and Smash then, Quest isn't like LV Smash, though. That's well, Smash 4. Well, yeah, but like pre-Smash Quest, LV tournaments didn't use UCF setups. Yes, you are correct. So, like, I'm just saying that, like, with that, you meant now. like, if you can do a dash back without UCF setups, then when you have it, it's just that much easier, you know? So, yep. that, that, that's what I was trying to get I, I'm that. with you then. I yeah. completely concur. I kind of phrased it like I thought you meant though. now. It's like, there's the little UCF letters <laughs> right there, man. Yeah, you're like, uh, bro, <laughs> can you read or are you illiterate? What happened? Who are you facing? Scry. Word. Do you know what your next opponent is? Word. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Who do we got coming in? I'm excited to see this particular Sheik once more. He definitely had a killer comeback against Zephyr earlier. Ass. I said ass. Ass. And titties. Okay. <laughs> I end right into it. I like that shine just. Yeah, you can hello help. there. Boink. Whoa. 
Alright, so... Pretty. Nate, since this is your house, tell him to stop yelling. <laughs> Rib Freddy Fish Stick. <laughs> That's just a Freddy <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, I like that forward tail. Falco's forward tail is so fast. I like that edge guard. That was nice and cool and calm. Yeah, very textbook. He didn't even need the back air there, but F it. Okay, awesome. so Lucid's doing well. That was a questionable roll on the on the platform. That was also another questionable roll. <laughs> shield turn around shield. Yeah, man. Combo. That way, when they shield pressure the back of your shield, they're actually pressuring the front of your shield, and you can grab it. <laughs> oh my gosh! Zephyr letting out some tilt. Okay, I like that air dodge to get kick the needles. <laughs> Okay. Lucid's doing well, really well getting out of the corner. Yeah. Like yeah. different than Sunny and the last Falcon we saw. Lucid's doing different stuff. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, I like the stage control he's got going on. Like he doesn't mind giving up center, but like every time he approaches, it's always on his terms. Like he's not yeah. doing any reckless approaching. Like that light shield to shield drop bear. There, I don't think there was any way Sheik was going to punish that, but it ended up getting him a good 20%. So. Yep. So it's very, like, low risk, low to medium reward, and that's fine, because if you just keep doing that, you'll eventually end up... Yeah, because if you're good in neutral, then that's a payoff strategy. Right yeah, there. exactly. If you have that confidence that your character or you as a player can beat the other person, okay. then... Uh, in neutral, then Too it's fine. Too bad that shine bear didn't hit, but he still cleaned it up with another bear. Yeah. But a strong one that time. Ooh, okay. Uh, yeah. That was just an uh, error. Tech yeah. error right there. Well. Yeah, could have gotten the tech, and uh, I'm sure there's plenty of things Falco could have done to punish the Sheik with death, but. Yeah, but Nakuya did sometimes. really well to take it. Yeah. Sometimes you have to take risks like that. Especially when you're down three stocks to one, you gotta clean up stocks as soon as you can. Okay, that jump off the ledge was a total tournament winner. That was desperation, but he's still playing well. On I like that. Wow. Oh my god, Ooh. keep it going. Oh, and oh barely. Oh my god, I got. <sighs> yeah, that was such right an there. insane start. That would have been like Ze almost okay, like a Zephyr stock, good. except there's another Falco stock. This is doable, but not easy. No, yeah, not at all. Here. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Rough. Definitely not the way you want to see it happen. Dude, this. We have some angry people in the crowd here. You can't just be saying boo like that. Yeah, you gotta scare people. Every time he says it, I have a little heart. Oh. There. Oh. Oh no. My poor Not like heart. This. That was hilarious. Okay. I mean, at least he didn't lose the stock, but he got like he got sixty-six percent. Yeah, that's off of that whole fucking. That was hilarious. Oh, really I rough. like those lasers. You're welcome. Not good was either lucky or very good with his timing, avoiding that shine. Yeah, because uh, that was perfectly spaced. It's okay. actually really frustrating as uh, any uh, character to collide with the side B. It's like you did everything right and you just happened to mistime it by frames. Lucid's also punishing the fact that Nakud gets off the ledge after a second, like yeah. every time. Doesn't matter what he does, as long as you know when they're going to get off, that makes the read so much easier. Yeah, because at that point, like, you can actually just kind of Did he hit the ground? Everything. Okay, it doesn't matter. Well, now he has. Yeah. Okay. I like that. I like it. All right. Man.
here.
Yeah. <laughs> 